Before you pack those lunches, chew on this. Consumer Reports says no American should be eating Lunchables regularly. CR says it has the testing to prove Lunchables are bad for anyone's health, especially kids. The Consumer Advocate says Lunchables are not a healthy option for kids and shouldn't be allowed on the menu as part of the National School Lunch Program. The organization tested kits served to kids through the NSLP and bought at the store. All of them had relatively high levels of lead and cadmium. All but one show the presence of a chemical found in plastic linked to reproductive issues, diabetes, and some cancers. Lead and cadmium can cause developmental problems in children, but none of the kits exceeded any federal limits. However, the CDC says no amount of lead is safe for children to consume. The sodium levels in store-bought Lunchables are at nearly a quarter of a kid's recommended daily intake. CR revealed the school versions were even higher, with more than half the recommended daily amount. The highest amounts of sodium were found in the turkey and cheddar Lunchables. Eating foods with high sodium can cause high blood pressure, leading to heart disease, stroke, and kidney damage. Currently, the USDA allows two Lunchable kits turkey and cheddar cracker stackers, and extra cheesy pizza. And they're available to nearly 30 million students. To meet the program's requirements, Kraft added more whole grains to crackers and more protein to the kit. CR has a petition urging the USDA to remove Lunchables from the school lunch program and replace it with healthier options. As of this report, it had nearly 15,000 signatures. The USDA said it does have roles to address the overall content of meals and Lunchables would need to be paired with fruits, vegetables and milk. Kraft said it has taken great steps to improve the nutrition profile of Lunchables, like reducing sodium in Lunchables crackers by 26 percent.